Hi, this is Mike Haber. Thanks for asking me, what is the difference between a technical and a substantive violation of probation? There's two types of probation violations, technical and substantive. A technical probation violation occurs when you either fail to complete or you willfully and substantially breach any condition of your probation, whether standard or special. Things like blowing a curfew or failing a urinalysis or missing a scheduled appointment, not completing community service hours, etc. A substantive violation means that you were arrested for a new crime that occurred after the time that you were placed on probation. Both technical and substantive violations are serious, and either of them can result in a probation revocation and land you in jail. But before you can be violated and sentenced for either a technical or a substantive violation of probation, you must first be afforded due process. And in the case of a VOP, due process means that you're entitled to notice, discovery, time to prepare, and an evidentiary hearing. In the end, if you're found guilty of a technical violation of probation, then you face the maximum sentence that you could have gotten before you were placed on probation minus credit for any time that you have actually spent in jail on that charge, but not including any time that you spent serving your probationary term. A substantive violation of probation subjects you to sentencing exactly like a technical, i.e. the max minus credit time served. But if you're ultimately found guilty of the new substantive charge, then you're also subject to a consecutive sentence on that new case. That said, I thank you very much for your question. I appreciate your having asked it, and I invite you to ask me more. Please remember that at Haber PA, it's all about reasonable doubt. And if you like this video, please subscribe to our channel. We'll be putting out more soon.